Tyrus, and you hungry? How are you? Yeah. Uh, boarding was smooth. Everything about that was smooth. Like, we got on here ASAP. Um, little safety thing was like easy. Um, I don't think what else. We're on deck three. The ship, you can't even feel it like moving right now. Um, when we first took off, he was like turning. Okay, so what do you think of the ship so far? It's alright. It's alright. Other than that, it's been fine. And I was really nervous that my husband was gonna get seasick because this is his first cruise, but he seemed to be doing fine, y'all, so I don't know. Right now, uh, we are chilling. Oh, I'm watching Fantastic Four. Well, I think it just ended. I, like, started watching it. Um, I really don't remember watching Fantastic Four, y'all, so now I feel like I need to watch them. And I kind of feel like it was a bit ahead of his time. I feel like maybe they need to remake it, I don't know. And then we have this comedy show at 11, and it's like, Right now it's like 10 o'clock. Um, it's at first come first serve as far as seats. So I'm thinking I'm gonna wake up at like 10.40. We left from Tampa. Um, I can feel the boat moving a little bit. <laughs> Anyways, we left from Tampa and um, Today is a sea day, like the rest of the day, I guess. And then, and we didn't leave until like, we didn't like start moving until like after five, I think. And then tomorrow it's an all day sea day. And then this bonnet is so tight. I need a new bonnet because this is not, this ain't doing it. Anyways, tomorrow is all day sea day. And then um, Wednesday, no, sorry. Today is Wednesday, tomorrow, Thursday is all day sea day. Friday, we go to Cosmo, Mexico. And then Saturday, we go to Costa Maya, Puerto, Puerto Costa Maya, Mexico. And then Sunday's all day today, and then we get back on Monday. I'm waiting for these credits to go out to see if I'm gonna watch something else. If not, I'm gonna read my book a little bit. Oh, and let me tell y'all about my book. Let's get into it. So, oh, I thought I changed the channel, but I didn't. Anyways, y'all, so. Do you guys, comment down below, if you guys um watch Bridgerton. Well, if you watch season one, like, I guess, if you watch season one. If you didn't watch season one, go watch season one. It's on Netflix and it's good. And I'm sorry that I like a little peanut, like a little mushroom cap with this bottom on. But, like, your girl is chilling. Your girl is chilling. We had dinner and then we came, we went to the card room and we played cards for, like, maybe an hour. Oh. We got here playing Remy on, I'm not gonna lie, he's clapping his cheeks, meaning I'm losing. This is a little cart room. I'm gonna give you all a tour later. Okay, so how was Mexico? Pretty good. Pretty real good. They love me out here. They want me to come back. I can never forget.
my little pina coladas. Always recommend it. Hey, you guys. With this guy get tequila, you don't need salt and lime. All right? Are this you kiss, sure? This, this tequila was very for just enjoy. Okay? Okay. And let me tell you why they use salt and lime. Mm -hmm. Sometimes they use salt and lime to hide the bad taste. Ah, okay. Or when you drink it, the tequila like straight, you feel like it's burning. Like a body. burning feeling, yeah. yeah. This yeah. tequila doesn't burn. Okay. All right. Now, there we go. And there we go. This is my other tequila. It smells kind of like vanilla. No? Tiny. Tiny? Okay. Sweet? Yeah. All right. Let me tell you, before we taste it, I wanna show you how to how to, to do it, okay? Okay. Once you take this one, you wanna feel you wanna feel the two taste you say, okay? Okay. And this one you wanna you wanna feel that earthy tone, grassy, and you wanna taste the agave. Okay. But this wanna be fresh at the same time, okay? Okay. Alright. How we wanna do? It's a lot of different agaves on, on Mexico, right? Right. Only with the blue, you know, the nominator, you know, you have to produce tequila, you know, see? Okay. If you produce tequila with other plants, not blue agave, you can not call it tequila now, you know? Ah, so uh, okay. See, it has to be blue agave to make the tequila, see? The white tequila, uh -huh. it is directly from the distillery. It's ah. like rum, you know? Right. You distill the rum, the rum and it's white. Okay. You distill tequila and it's white, you know? Okay. White, it means, you know, it's directly from the distillation to the bottom. Ah. You don't have age process, you know? Right. Aging process, it comes on the bottle, you know? They have a smoked old bottle. So age process, you know, is six months for the reposado, you know? Okay. The, the, um, the little darker, reposado. More darker, golden, is añejo, you know? Okay. Añejo is aged, you know? And extra añejo is very aged, you know? All extra aged, you know? So is the reposado more expensive? No. No? The, the more time on the oak barrel, more time to produce it, more mm -hmm. expensive it is, yes. Oh, okay. That's, that's the, the good tequila, you know, processing. You know, when you let the plant grow in containers, the barrels, uh -huh. you know, and they bottle it in the United States, you know. Ah. But that's, that's money, you know, so they, uh, they buy the cheap tequila, uh -huh. they burn a little sugar, they add it to them, and they make it the color, you know, fake. I didn't know that. So is there a place to buy, like, really good tequila out here? Really? That's the place I told you, you can taste and you can take it all, you know, they wrap it for you, so you can use the clear on the boat, when they finish the cruise, they take it. And like you're in Florida, don't need to travel it, you can carry any bottles you want. <laughs> ah, okay. But the, the cruise ship only let you five, five bottles per person, yeah? Right. Yes.
So, I kind of just want to show you what we got from Mexico. We honestly did not buy a lot just because we kind of spent our money more so on like food and drinks and activities and stuff like that, which you'll see I have a couple of clips of that. But I did just want to say, um, I feel like I wanted to get more footage, but I didn't just because I was kind of living in the moment, you guys. Like, it was my husband's first time on a cruise and it was our first like real time, um, I guess, vacationing outside of like driving somewhere you know what i mean so like i kind of wanted to just be in the moment and just enjoy our time together so i got as many clips as i could but honestly i was having a ball and we were just vibing like it was just a vibe but i did want to show you what i got so i got this from cozumel um in costa maya we really didn't buy much stuff um that's where we like pretty much drank and ate and all that stuff like that Okay, so as I was saying, sorry, my hair looks a hot mess. I literally took my wig off and I haven't done my hair yet, but I'm doing it today. But anyways, I wanted to show you what we got. Something for um, our cousin and we sent it to her already. Um, I'm not gonna say what it is because I'm gonna post this today and she won't have it by today, so. But we got her something nice. Um, it was like a Christmas gift. And I was like, well, why don't we just get her something, you know, from Mexico, I feel like it would be more exciting. So we got her that. So that was like two things that we bought for her. And then we got these. Now, you know, we go out the country, like everybody's making these or whatever. So I really wanted a U.S. Bulls one. I hope you can see it. But it says USF Bulls because that's where me and my husband went to college. And then my husband's favorite like basketball team is Kentucky. So he got that one. And then he got his friend a shirt um, from Costa Maya. And then from Costa Maya, I got myself this cool shirt. Look at it, y'all. It's so raw. Like, I love this shirt, y'all. Hold on, let me do it so you can see it. But he's serving them pizza. And their skulls, they look... It's so cool, y'all. But yeah, so... I got this from Costa Maya. Which it says Costa Maya at the bottom, y'all. But like... They got beers and stuff. It's so freaking cute, y'all. Um, but that's the shirt that I got for myself. And then I got myself, okay. So this shirt in the front, it just says Costa Maya. And then the back, isn't that cute? It just says Costa Maya, Mexico. So I got myself that shirt. So we got these three shot glasses. They're so cute. Like, they're so colorful, y'all. But here's for my most excited things I got. Can you guess what it is? 
It's so pretty though. Now the price of this, I think was, it was either 25 or $35. I do appreciate them wrapping this junk up like this. But jeez. Isn't she gorgeous? Somebody painted this, y'all. Look at it. It's so freaking pretty. And it says Cosmo down here. Hold on, hold on. You see that? It's so freaking pretty, y'all. If you don't know me, um, well, I'm gonna tell you about me now. And this is the back. Isn't it beautiful? Oh my gosh, it's so beautiful. But I love art. Like I used to do pottery and stuff like that and when I was in high school. And I was really into art and drawing and painting and all those things so like when i saw this i was like oh my god i gotta have it so she said you can put it on like your dining room table like as a centerpiece or you can hang it on the wall so i'm thinking you know when we buy a house and stuff like that this could be something that goes on the wall and i'm thinking maybe every place we go i'll get something like this to hang on our wall and then we can have a wall just like full of them like as art i don't know i thought it'd be cool let me know what y'all think but this is literally this is my favorite thing that i got y'all like she is just so beautiful Oh my goodness. Where does it say? Oh, it says Cosmo here. Oh my goodness. So beautiful, y'all. But this, I think, was like $25 for $30. $25 or $30, which I think is cheap. Like, I feel like it should have been more worth. I feel like it's, it should have been more. Um, but it's just beautiful. It's so beautiful, y'all. So that's the end of, like, what we got from our trip kind of haul. Um... Yeah, that's that's pretty much what we got. We didn't get much, like I said. We kind of just had fun and did stuff. Um, but this is literally by far the most like precious thing that I got. It's just beautiful. So I wanted to put that here on the video so that you guys could see it. Excuse my hair, but yeah.